So here we go then. It's Marcus Delmeida of Brazil in the yellow and uh, Ricardo Soto of Chile in the red. And we've seen Ricardo in action in a, a number of the events and disciplines here. En el blanco número uno y representando a Brasil, on target number one, representing Brazil, Marcus Delmeida. En el blanco número dos y representando a Chile, on target number two, representing Chile, Ricardo Soto. The 21-year-old, he was beaten by his teammate Andres Aguilar in the quarterfinals of the Olympic qualifiers yesterday in this same range. Uh, so this is his second chance to shine here in Monterrey. Aguilar, by the way, went on to take the silver. But they did enough to qualify their nation to the Olympic Games. But now this is all about him and whether he can come away with a Pan American title. Ricardo Soto facing the top ranked archer from Brazil, Marcus Delmeida, 23 years old. And he will shoot first. Nueve, 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 siete, seven. Nueve, scoring, nine. more consistent f shooting from the men than we've seen in the women's competition. And that first set has gone to Marcus Delmeida. Got an insurmountable lead. Nueve, and he takes nine. it 28 25, goes two up. Walking to the sea. So, first impressions. It's a very good start for Marcus. I think uh, Ricardo had just a little bit, needed a little bit more time to get used to the wind again. Uh, Marcus is the clear favorite, you know, uh, after having had bad experiences at the home games uh, five years ago. He's just coming back Resultado to a better level oficial, and with a stronger Marcus mental de de Brasil, cero punto de set, Ricardo Soto de Chile. Very young Michel at his Martin home Olympic two Games, set points, there's a, a lot of expectations to bear on Ricardo his teenage Soto shoulders. We have a much more confident, self-assured archer now uh, in the 23-year-old. Certainly, if that first set's anything to go by, he's going to be tough to beat. Nueve, nine. Ocho, eight. Ocho las nueve, prácticamente. Nueve, nine. Mind it's the first to six set points in recurve that wins the match. Nueve, Yes. Great final Ten. arrow. In fact, a great set from him. 28 points for Ricardo Soto. And 
and that means it's all square. Nine. Two points each. Ricardo looks a lot more relaxed than he did yesterday. I think having to shoot against his teammates was, you know, extra pressure because they know each other so well. The careers um, of these two kind of mirrors as, in as much as the Olympic Games are concerned. I mean, Marcus Delmeda, yes, he was on, on home soil, so the Resultado pressure was, was huge on him. But at the same time, Ricardo arquero. Soto turned up Bishop representing Marcel Chile as the youngest archer for at the archer. Games. You know, just 16 years old. That's, that's immense pressure to take. And he did very well, finishing ninth. Nueve, nine. Nueve, nine. These two at the moment pretty well matched, aren't they? Yeah. What, what, what do you think will make the difference? I think reading the wind Nueve. is going to be... Nueve, nine. It doesn't look too windy right now, so... Ocho. Eight. Siete, seven. Oh, he gets a nine, Nueve. so the set goes nine. to Soto, 26-20. Resultado parcial oficial, dos puntos de set, Marcus de Almeida de Brasil, cuatro puntos de set, Ricardo Soto de Chile. Partial official results, uh, Marcus de Almeida from Brazil, two set points, Ricardo Soto from Chile, four set points. Well, that third set, often a crucial one to take. And it does mean now that... Ricardo Soto is just a set away from victory. Yes. Ten. Ocho. Eight. Another 10. Yes, 10. Well, if ever he needed to hit form, it was in this third set, in this fourth set. Nueve, nine. Advantage Dalmeida. He needs to at least draw it for the set. To save Nueve. the match. And nine. That's a nine. Could hardly have done any more. So a great score from Marcus Delmeda. Ocho. And Eight. it is now four all.
often happens, doesn't it, when you get to the semi-final stages, the quality is so high that they often go to the fifth set and even a shoot-off. Yeah, especially when, you know, the conditions are changing and you have ends where they don't seem to be bothered by the wind and then the next one it's breezy and they struggle to hold the boost. Resultado parcial oficial, cuatro puntos de set para cada arquero. Partial official results, four set points for each arc. Enjoyable for us. Set five. If someone wins the set, they win the match. If it's a draw, we go to a shoot off. Nueve posible diez. Nine possible ten. Nueve, nine, diez, ten. Great second arrow from Dalmeida under pressure. Nueve. Nine. One big difference between both archers is uh, Ricardo will move his sight after every single arrow. Just, you know, that one click. Ocho, possible nueve. Eight, possible nine. Probably reset himself more than his sight. So there's nine points between them now. He needs a nine or better. He gets the nine. Nueve. So it's Nine. 27 apiece, but we have to wait for the checks on those two arrows of Marcus, of Marcus Delmeida. You certainly need a magnifying glass, don't yeah, you? Yeah, <laughs> they both seem you know, close enough for the judge to struggle. Apparently he won. The Brazilian teammate was like going yay with his fist. So uh, looks like he's giving it to him. It looks like Soto Ganador is going out. De la segunda semifinal en el recurvo masculino, Marcus de Almeida de Brasil en el blanco número uno. Winner it, of the second semifinal match, Marcus de Almeida from Brazil on target number one. Ricardo Soto de Chile Marcus pasará Delmeida a disputar la medalla de bronce. The final and Ricardo, Ricardo Soto, from Soto Chile will be well, on he the went one better than in the Olympic qualifiers yesterday, making it through to the semi-finals, but he'll be disappointed to be knocked out again before making uh, making it to that gold medal match. But uh, celebrations for the Brazilian and uh, the members of his team. And now he will be watching with interest we will the second semi-final but an absorbing contest from these two yes very tight match and you know to the last arrow to a judge call Continuamos yeah, so con el segundo partido de semifinal. Now we will follow with the second semifinal match. Démosle la bienvenida a los atletas del segundo match. Right, well, Let's welcome now the contenders so for the second semifinal match. To, uh, the tunnel area where they make their appearance. It's Colombia against Brazil this time. 